Hello everybody and welcome back to Planet Crafter. The last time we did some exploring and some uh, self-improvement, we have unlocked the jetpack. And now we're also much faster and better storage and can breathe easier. So for this episode, I'm wanting to continue to move stuff over from the uh, station that we salvaged, not pilfered, salvaged. And yeah, we're going to start doing some constructing of some better power, uh, maybe some water collecting, stuff like that. All right, well, let's start moving stuff over. Actually, you know what? Energy is a minus 11 per second. Is it 11 kilowatts? Okay, maybe we should handle this first. The so water. Okay, so for now, I'm going to harvest some stuff. We'll make the nuclear reactor and then the water collector. And then we'll start moving stuff over. All right, sounds good. I tell you what, flying really is the way to uh, travel. We're so fast. And there's no fuel to worry about. We don't have enough super alloy here, do we? We don't. Oh, sad. Okay. So, I'm just going to have to keep changing my mind on what we're doing right now, but that's totally fine. We're going back to the maze, to that station that we looked through, and we're going to get all the stuff that was in there. I'll tell you what, this maze is a lot less scary during the daytime. Oh. Okay. I'm only slightly lost, but I found another uh, chest, so that's that's a win. All right. So we're gathering all the important stuff out of here. Mostly the super alloys. Ooh, I want to grab some of these mushrooms, too. I thought I was lost there, but we're good. I'm loving the new O2 tank, too. I had no idea we unlocked tier 4. I guess that's just the new crafting station just gives us those recipes for it. Which I'm not complaining. Legit. Okay. Just need the uranium rod. Which luckily we... Okay, hold on. Luckily we have one of. And... What else do we need? Just a water bottle. Don't worry, I can make one of those. Look at that. We're gonna put this really far away because I I don't think radiation is a problem, but still. We can put in our drills. Totally fine. Totally, totally, totally fine. Let's sit it right here. Check it out. Wow, look at that. 86.5 kilowatts. That's incredible.
I can't wait to check our power grid. But before that, we really need to work on water collection. Silicone, magnesium, cobalt. Right? Great. This one, I'm going to just kind of put right out here. A biodome. Let's go. Okay. So it'll just make or collect water for us. That looks really cool. I like that a lot. I want the ice because I kind of need water now. Ooh, there we go. I should make some more food growers. Need water for that. Okay, that, that's fine. We're just going to hang out here and work on that. I should probably make some more storage. This one, I guess I'll specifically make it for... Uranium. Because I have a good amount of that now. to rethink some strategy here. That's totally fine. Gridium. Okay, so we will grab all of the ceridium. And we'll put it in there. Simple enough. So we have food, uranium, iridium, common and uncommon. And then this is food. I should probably change, make one for seeds. All right, this one will be for seeds. I have more seeds than I thought I did. And that's okay. Oh, it's raining in the base. Perfect. Look at that. That's awesome. And we have one water bottle. Perfect. Okay, so now I'm going to create some more food growers. Aluminum and iron. Oh, we've got enough iron left. I want to create two because I want to get here we go uh, for this one I want to put these mushroom seeds because I think these are used for some stuff much water nothing else yet that is a-okay this is going much slower but getting to range good okay so what now we have o2 is really kicking off we need to increase heat Yeah, heat's gonna be big. Kinda. Okay. Okay.
Hmm. I do like that tier four. All right, yeah, let's check our power. Whoa. See, now that's a number I can, I can really get behind. Let's see. You know what? We're going to do something that I said I was going to do, and I haven't gotten around to yet. I'm going to go back to the first base and start moving some stuff. Thank you. All right. Yeah, so this area right here, it's essentially going to turn into a lake. So I've, I've mentioned that before, but I really need to just finish getting everything else out of here. Not much left, and a lot of which is lower tier stuff, so it's not really going to matter anyway. But just want to make sure we have everything of importance. There we go. You can deconstruct things from the inside. Okay. One more. Okay. Wow, this cleanup's going so much faster. Oh yeah, I gotta grab those solar panels next. Okay, so we'll just head back, deposit some stuff, and uh, come back here, finish that up, and then reevaluate. All right. Not seeds. There we go. Okay. Iridium. Common's already full. But that's totally fine. We have enough materials we can really start to expand. But I'm going to go back, like I said, and heck of everything else. Wow, look at that nuclear glow right there. Pretty awesome. Okay. Got a whole bunch of stuff now. I really need to make some more storage. Didn't want to do it, but there we go. I'm just moving this to be the new seed one. And I will make the other one more common stuff. Yeah. And I'll make that one be the new food one. Got thirsty. Remember hydrate pokes. Gotta check our water output. Look at that, we have two now. I think it's going pretty fast, not gonna lie. I wanna craft another food grower. I need some iron and an aluminum. Alright. I'm going to grab some more iron we're going to expand this side a little bit
There we go. Now we've got some more room. There we go. Seeds are here. This one. And those are going to be fairly important. I think they... Like I said, I think they make some other stuff. Okay. Alright, so what do we need next? Eat. I believe we have another we've got a rod silicone titanium and aluminum so we can actually make a tier three and look at that we had loose power The heat's going up fairly well. Yeah, look, we need a lot of heat. It really gets to some crazy stuff. Okay. Oh, grow plants and generate O2. Biodome does seem pretty cool. How do we want to do it though? But so far we've got storage through here, farming and growing stuff that way, heat generation that way. So with all the stuff that we have access to, Biodome doesn't seem crazy. We do want to make a launch platform. So maybe we should do that first. Yeah, I think we should. It's super alloys. Right? Yep. Well, we can do it. Luckily, this does not have to be connected to the base, so I'm wanting to put the launch platform, I think, over here. Really? How much power does that thing take? Fifty-five? Oh my god, we're gonna have to make another nuclear reactor. I think we can do it, but... Jeez. Already? We won't be able to make... One yet we're gonna need more super alloy oh yeah we did put that tier 3 heater up but 55 though that's that's huge good enough Man, that's just crazy I don't think we have enough super alloys yeah we just have one okay that is a okay. Okay. Any other improvements we need to do? For now, no. We just really need to make numbers go bigger. Okay. 
Let's see. Oxygen we're working on. We need to increase that heat. Yeah. Need to increase heat. I want to still be able to walk through here though. I could probably still put another tier two, so I will do that. Yep, I can still walk past. I increase the heat a little bit. Okay, so I think I'm going to end that episode for now. Next time, we're just going to have to really worry about gathering resources. Okay, so until next time, thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe and leave some comments. Alright, bye everybody.